think this has connected, but I'm not entirely sure, so you might get this, you might not, because it says connecting across my face right now, and I waited for that to finish for like two minutes last time I tried this, and it turned out it was actually connected the whole time, so you just got like two minutes of me just sitting there, completely like statue still, waiting for it to connect, I didn't realise I was actually sitting so still until I watched it back. So this is attempt number three, I hope it works, and I can't wait till I get some proper editing software, because this sucks absolute balls. Really, it does. I mean, YouTube straight record from webcam. It's just horrible. Um, okay, so I have to just repeat everything I just said. Um, let's try and see if I can make it better. So, today, what did I do today? Today I went to work. Except, I started at 1 on my alarm went off at 5.15. Why did my alarm go off at 5.15, you ask? That's a very good question. Because my boyfriend started at work at 7. So the alarm goes off at 5.15, his alarm goes off at 5.30 roll out of bed somewhere around 6-ish and he gets ready for work and I go back to sleep till I need to get up. It's a great system. Only I didn't actually go back to sleep. Well, I did, but I had a nightmare, so it woke me up and I didn't get enough sleep. So, I propose a question for you. Is it a nightmare if it's during the day? Because I was asleep, it would have been about 8am. And I had a nightmare, but it's during the day. So does that make it a daemon? Which isn't quite as terrifying or scary sounding. Completely off topically random, my mic is really bad quality, so if it's like. <laughs> I'm sorry, I really am. I'm, I'm working on it, I promise, I'm really working on it. Um, so yeah, then I spent five hours of retail hell. Because you know, that's what retail is retail hell. Especially when you work for a major department store. Um, and yay, it's just connected, although I'm pretty sure it's been connected for the last minute 55 that I've been talking. Yesterday, I went out to lunch with my mom's family for my grandma's birthday, and my boyfriend met my mom's family for the first time. And it actually went really well, thank goodness. Um, so yeah, that was great fun. I'm talking about boyfriends. My boyfriend, I talk about him a lot, I really miss him. He's sort of living with me at the moment, because my house is closer to work, and as I said, he starts at 7 in the morning. And um, while I was at work, he came home and got ready for an awards night, his work is home tonight. Well, his work is for moms and I'll probably like that. Um, but anyway, came home and got ready and now my room stinks of aftershave. Well, he says it's aftershave and Google says it's cologne, so I'm not quite sure. Whatever, it stinks. Like seriously, he's gonna kill me if he ever finds out that I upload this. But seriously, my room now stinks of this. Like, blah! So, yeah. And, um, he's just sent me a message saying one of the guys from work has bought him a scotch and coke, which, no, that's not the problem, I don't mind him drinking, and I'm not an overprotective girlfriend or anything, it's the fact that he starts work at 7 tomorrow morning, and he's going drinking and going to the casino, so it's going to be fun trying to get him up in the morning, especially since I start at 8 and have to leave at 7, so tomorrow morning is going to be an eventful morning, and one, if not both of us, may very well be late for work, so, I'm on that one, <laughs> um, what else, oh, I've started reading a new book, yes, I've been not new to a lot of you since I'm pretty sure it's been around a long time, so long that the author actually died before he could complete the last book. But I'm jumping on the bandwagon now. Before I recommended it, the beginning of the Robert Jordan Wheel of Time series. I really like it. Nothing much is happening, yet I still really want to be reading it. Good book thing, I guess. All day at work, I'm just like, no, they want to be reading. Stupid customers, they want to be reading. But no, unfortunately, we can't take our books out. To us. Um, wow, well, I jump up topics a lot, don't I? It'd be so good when I can edit this and put the right topics all together. Um, I want your opinion on something, watchers, if we have more than just contributors. Um, do you think it's inhumane to make someone work from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. with only a 15 minute break? I mean, I'm starving by the end of that. You have breakfast at like 6 in the morning. By 8 o'clock, you're hungry again. You start work at 8. You get 15 minutes in the middle, which is long enough to go to the toilet, fill up your water bottle, and eat a music bar, and then get back downstairs. That's all the time you've got. So you don't get into the eat much, and then you finish at one. I'm absolutely starving by the time I finish. I don't have money to go buy food. I'm saving. Do you think it's in your way? Or am I just being a whingy little thing? It's just very good. Um, yeah, opinions. I don't know if 
we want to set another challenge for the week or what. But if you're struggling to talk about something in your video or you just want to be nice to me so I don't look like a twat, I think you should show me what you're reading. Whether it be a uh, book, oh, I was going to grab a magazine, but I don't have one handy. <laughs> a magazine, a textbook, a web page, a blog, a fan tales wrapper, a Libra Invisible wrapper. I don't know. What are you reading? I want to know. I'm a nose and stuff like that. Um, I think I've rambled on about as much as I rambled in the last one. This turned out to be extremely long, and if you sat through all this, well done. <laughs> if you didn't, well, you won't be here this week, so this was kind of my first um, Yeah. It's the end of Monday now, and I'm signing off. And if she's not busy, I guess I will see you tomorrow, Tori Tuesday, and I hope you make it because I missed your video last week. And yay for Caitlin for making surprise Sunday. It was Good to see you. I, I thought you weren't going to make it. Um, and other Tory, yes, the Jelly Dream House is awesome. It took me so long to figure out the name. I was like, Jelly House? Where did I from? And suddenly one day it just clicked. I'm like, oh my gosh, Tory's door! Which I'm pretty sure there's a, there's a um, shark on the back of the door as well, and like flowers, and oh, I don't know, there's so much cool stuff painted on the back of her door. I really hope she shows us on Tuesday. It's really awesome. So yeah, um, and is, is mine playing up or did Amelia not upload on Friday? If not, we miss you Amelia, you haven't started yet, you totally should because you're awesome. Um, and wow, I sound like a traumatic again. Um, <laughs> yeah, goodbye.